What's up all you action figure lovers out there? Master Marvel's back at it once again bringing you another action figure review. Tonight we're going to take a look at the Transformers Studio Series, Transformers Revenge of the Fallen. We have Constructicon Hightower here. And before I get into this, this video is not meant for kids. It's for adult collectors only. So yes, uh, Constructicon Hightower. And as you see, I have a headless one here. It is in the box. Um, looks to me like it just fell off. So no big deal. We'll repair that when we get it opened. Um, so let's go ahead and do that. Let's get this guy out of the package. Take a look at it. And we'll try to compare it to some of the other ones I have already reviewed from this movie. Okay. So he looks like he's a pretty cool figure. I see this guy a lot. He's a peg warmer. So... Uh, it's unfortunate, but, you know, there's always got to be one, right? Ugh. There it is. My instruction booklet on transforming this bad boy. Gots to have it. Okay. We'll take a look at that later. All right. Get this big crane piece here. And as far as these, uh, to build the big, uh, I forgot his name. Um, I have three out of five to do it. So I definitely got some more of these I need to track down. Um, let's see here. legs bend here all right <laughs> I'm stupid so I gotta look at the back of the box here uh, looks like this goes up this attaches somewhere right in there try to get his head back on here okay he's got these little t-rex arms <laughs> and these I guess that's it, man. That's... <laughs> yeah, uh, not the most thrilling of Transformers, I guess. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know. This is weak, but it is in the movie. So I'll give you guys a closer look of him here. Uh, yeah, very funny looking. And I guess this can be, I don't know, you could do what you want with it. I guess there's no real, real right or wrong way to sit this piece, but I just kind of have it rolled up high. Um, and yeah, that's all we have. I mean, his head moves, does turn, but mine, that piece just wants to fall right out of there, so... I just don't want to mess with it too much. Okay, so uh, here's his backdrop. I'll stick him on here for a second to see, and yeah, I figured. 
see if he stays on here. Shit. What the fuck? This motherfucker here. <laughs> Okay, well there he is on his thing so but yeah that didn't look right um, well let me pull out some people to compare him to real quick and get him to stand again let's see what's going on here there turn that in out. I guess that's a little bit better. <laughs> okay. Anyways, uh, mix master here. There's one to, from the movie, and also one that merges with his big counterpart deal which I forgot what the hell it's called <laughs> um, but yeah so these look good together I like them and the only other figures I have from this movie and I don't really want to pull them all out but they're these little uh, motorcycle dudes RC and Whoever else. I think Arlita won. Or whatever might be one of these. So. Anyways. I'll have more soon. But yeah. That's it for now. Uh, there's nothing really else to say about this guy. He's just a little cheesy I think. But it's he's not bad though. I'm not going to say this is a bad figure. Uh, it's just a little different. So. Anyways, you guys let me know what you think of it, of course. And, uh, don't forget to like, comment, and share. And as always, it's your boy Master Marvel Lady here doing the damn thing. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And I will catch you guys later. Peace.